Will COVID-19 ever end in Malaysia? This is the question that may linger in our minds right now. However, we must not lose hope. As mentioned by Dr. Kasai during WHO Winter Press Conference this year, the crucial point for the COVID-19 response is not to rely on just one measure, but to use a combination. The vaccine is an excellent example, but it alone cannot put COVID-19 under control. Still, together with public health and social measures, we can suppress COVID-19. With this comes the role of COVID-19 Rapid Antigen Self-Test Kits, or in short form, RTK. So, what is RTK? In Malaysia, RTK is also a common way of diagnosing whether or not you have been infected with the virus. It has two types of kits, which one require nasal swab, while the other simply by your saliva. As the name implies, it takes only 15 minutes to get the result. The apparent advantage is that Using the RTK when one of the family members in the house develops symptoms of COVID-19 will lead to more excellent control management and quick execution of necessary COVID-19 preparedness action to safeguard the whole family from getting the infection of the coronavirus. However, RTK is still a brand new product created to tackle the spread of coronavirus in our community. This is because our Malaysian government first introduced the self-test kit to the public in July this year. Because of that, the lack of awareness about RTK is pretty alarming in our society, as not all households in Malaysia own this kit. As we are at the alarming stage in the pandemic, it is crucial for everyone to be aware of how they can use the RTK as a precaution and early ways to detect infection. Every house must have the RTK as it is cheaper for storage and simple for everyone to do a self-test at home. With that comes the role of technology in promoting awareness about RTK among Malaysians, which is by using mobile application entertainment, education, social networking, and productivity are all common things people do when using mobile application. Given the tremendous consumption of mobile phones and handheld device, the use of mobile application to teach and raise social awareness for the RTK will deliver great outcomes in this study. To further support this research, I will build a mobile app. In order to expose everyone to the RTK, all the infos necessary will be provided in the mobile application. For example, where to get junior kits in the market, what types of kits are available, the price of each kit, how to use it, and what needs to be done after getting the test result. There also will be a guide on updating the test result in mass Jatra. As it is easier for our Ministry of Health to keep track of and manage any COVID-19 operates in Malaysia. Therefore, it is very important to raise awareness about RTK to all nations, and one way of it is through developing interactive mobile application. The app is one of the ways that will help play a significant role in helping provide a better informed and healthier life with good protection by fully utilizing self-test kits to prevent the outbreak of COVID-19 among the people in Malaysia. That's all from me. Thank you.